the 2020 Audi RS Q8 4.0 Quattro. It's a fast one, folks. Glacier white, black, red stitching, black optic package, package carbon optic package, luxury package, executive package, all kinds of packages. And this is the really fast one. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Celebrity Cars. We're located just off the strip. All the shiny buildings where you come here on vacation. If you're a car person, you gotta get out. You can get out one day. You can come check out everything we have to offer in here. We've got American muscle cars. We've got uh, old European Ferraris. We've got Shelby's. We have uh, Al Capone's 1928 Bulletproof Cadillac. We've got all kinds of cool stuff to, to, to check out. But uh, today, uh, you clicked on this Audi. Uh, it, has, it doesn't have 20,000 miles yet on the odometer. It just shows under 20,000 miles. Uh, it's a, a very popular white. Did I say it's very fast? <laughs> yeah, this, this, is, this is the one you pay up for, folks. This is the one that, uh, you know, all the money. <clears throat> it's got carbon fiber all over it. I can see it now. The side mirrors are carbon fiber. Anyway, my, my, my job here is to go over the condition of these vehicles. Okay, this has just got, it's a 2020. Somebody's been enjoying it. Um, 20,000, just under 20,000 miles on the odometer. Look at the carbon fiber around the front. Look how cool that is. Anyway, yeah, my job here is to do, be the condition guy. So I tell you how many cuts, bruises, scrapes are on these vehicles out here for sale, okay? Um, <clears throat> since this is a 2020, under, under 20,000 miles <clears throat> on the odometer, let's see what we have to offer here. Okay, let's see. I have a small mark there, a small mark there. Let's see if there's any clear bra. I don't feel any. I don't feel any down here. So real small mark in the carbon fiber there, there. Uh, I'm not gonna pick at these, the rest of them, until I see ones that actually mean something. Yeah, this has been driven, folks, so I can't pick out every single mark, but you know what? Darn it, I can't find any more. This whole front end is really beautiful. I haven't looked at this yet, so you, we're doing this together. That's, that's the way it goes. I don't, I don't get a chance to get my hands all over every single vehicle that comes in here. There's no scrapes underneath. The headlight's in beautiful shape. I barely see any pitting in it whatsoever. These black... Uh, air intakes are gorgeous. The white down here is beautiful. This is a bug. It's gone now. So there you go. Oh, I see a little, this didn't get washed down here. Oh, that sucks. All right, sorry about that. That's gonna bug the hell out of me. Uh, it, it's, uh, it's, in, it's, it's hidden down there. <laughs> okay, so there you go. Uh, I don't think anyone's ever cleaned it to be fair. Uh, I don't see any marks, I don't see any hidden anything on it, and uh, I'll clean that up before you come by it. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, let's get a good look at this big piece of white right here, which would be the hood. I'm looking for egg corns. I'm looking for hail damage. I'm looking for anything that would be, that would just annoy the crap out of uh, its new owner. And I see nothing. Oh, look at that. Just one. Now my finger got dirty from being under the car. Just one. Look at that. Let's go over here. Let's see if we find any more. It's a little expedition. Nope. Okay, so great big beautiful sheet of white. I, it's, it's beautiful. I don't, I don't know what else to say. It should be. Let's look at these body panels, make sure they're all still one color. Uh, I believe there's really light curb rash on one wheel and it's right here. It's right on the edge. Nobody's gonna notice it. I'm just telling you about it. Okay. Wheel wells are nice and clean. I'm gonna stand down here, all the way down here. And I'm gonna look down the side of the car to see if I see any dings. No dings. All down along the whole bottom is beautiful. I don't see any signs of anybody doing any off-road, anything banging up underneath here. It's all in good shape. 
Once again, here's the rear wheel and tire. And there's no curb rash on this wheel and tire. It's in great shape. All up here is beautiful. Let's uh, let's go to let's go to the passenger side, Quincy, and then uh, and then we'll spin it around so we can get some good light on the back. Passenger side, front wheel and tire. Nothing. Beautiful. Look at those brake calipers. Look at the size of my dog. Okay. Uh, all along here looks good. I'm gonna ch check for dings and dents. Those annoying things that you get in the parking lot. Paint color, all of it's beautiful. Man, this is white, 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 white. Okay, rear wheel and tire, nice. Super clean. All right, let's hit this really cool button. Maybe Quincy, you help everybody uh, get a, a good perspective of the car again from back here. Spinning around. <clears throat> We've had this car, folks, for a day. We got it washed and shined up. It was already in pretty good shape when we got it. The, uh, the moon roof up here, everything looks good up here, too. I don't see any crazy bird stains or anything going on up there. Everything looks great. Might be one small little section there we gotta clean up in the middle. I think the young lady washing the car, she couldn't reach it. That's okay. <gasps> okay, don't do that. All right, come on back here. Oh man, this is beautiful. Look at this thing. I love the carbon fiber along with the really shiny black. That's sharp. All right. I'm gonna freeze up the carousel. I see a drip down here from, uh, you know, the water dripping from getting it washed. It's no big deal. Um, what I don't see which is great is a bunch of uh, you know scratches getting stuff in and out of the back of this so that's good news all this is in really yeah i gotta clean up just the, the water that was shining down got some extra floor mats back here i don't know what the heck this is uh but uh you know probably some kind of bike rack roof roof rack kind of thing that's what it looks like that's what it is so we get some extra parts back here and all that cool stuff see the back of the, the black seats you start to see the red stitching which is really sharp and we'll get to that in a couple minutes I do see you know like maybe some luggage maybe some groceries went in and out of the back here but they did a really good job of not banging up and marking up this whole back sill so good that really cool button works now let's go make sure that nobody backed in anything most cars have all these backup cameras now it's super fancy got a tow package on here I know you got to pay extra for that um, but uh, you know, you get the backup cameras now. You see, you don't you don't have to hit anything anymore. Jeez, look at these exhaust pipes. Whoosh. Well, I got nothing. The fuser's all clean. Wonderful. Okay, let's open some doors. Hey, you get to know what the red stitching and black is. I'm talking about. It's on the doors. A little carbon fiber thrown all the way around. Audi Sport logo shining on the ground every time I open up a door. And folks, this leather seating is uh, pretty much, jeez, uh, I want to lay down and take a nap in it. That's how nice this feels. I don't know where they got it from, but it feels a little different than everything else. Center console is beautiful. Nobody spilled heavy coffee in here. There's no fruity pebbles laying around from any kids. There's no sticky stuff laying around. All these screens and dash pad things. We'll, 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 we'll turn the car on later on. We'll see all this illuminate. Get to get, check that out. Dash pads nice and clean. Everything in here is exactly the way it should be, folks, for it being a, you know, a, a little older than just a year old. This beautiful car. It's beautiful. It smells good in here. Carbon fiber across the front. It's, this is awesome. Okay, no signs of uh, wear getting in and out of the car. No signs of any kind of wear over here in the passenger side door. Gonna look in the back seat here real quick. Same thing to report. Same thing to report. These carpets are beautiful. That's a pretty cool color. And again, the <clears throat> it really feels nice. It feels like a carpet you'd have in your house instead of a car. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nope. Bare barely used. I don't see boo. Nothing. I always like to check these bolsters getting in and out of cars, but this car's so new, yeah, we, we barely have any sign of wear at all getting in and out of the car. 
This black piece right here, still brilliant black, didn't fade, do any of that stuff. All right, let's open the hood. Let's see this big power plant makes this thing go fast. Oh, yes. Okay, so in all honesty, it doesn't look like our detailers got to this portion of the car, which was, you know, sometimes is good because then you get to see, uh, you know, the overall care of the vehicle while it was, uh, you know, being used. And, um, you know, it's just a little dusty in here, but other than that, nothing ever looked messed with. I don't even see anybody playing with charging the battery. We're all in good shape. Nice. Okay, well, I'm not really sure we need to drive this car around the block, but hey, since it's got a great big fancy motor in it, let's see how fast it goes. <laughs> yeah, I'm just kidding. Uh, but we're going to drive around the block, make sure it does all the things it's supposed to do. We'll be right back. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Inside the 2020 Audi RS Q8. Uh, it's running because, you know, it's 100 million degrees outside and uh, you know, it's kind of sort of still a, a brand newish kind of car. You didn't really need to hear it start. I do regret not starting it in the showroom for you to hear it because of this having the, the bigger motor and, you know, all the money. It's got a to it, which is pretty cool. Uh, everything in here looks great. Drivers, I've got a uh, heads up display going on. Um, I'm in park, but it's already looking behind me. This thing's got options out the uh, out the window. All right, my foot's on the brake. I'm going to address drive and my foot's off the brake and off we go. Two hands on the wheel. Just going to make sure this thing does everything it's supposed to do. Forty-six miles an hour. Let's see what these brakes look. Three, two, one. Woohoo! That is a big car. The brake, it's wonderful. Wow, the grip and yeah, it feels great. And if you notice something, you know, as soon as I, I shut up back there and we started driving, you probably didn't hear anything. You know why? Because it's really darn quiet in here, which is awesome. Only thing you could probably hear in the background is the air conditioner. Sorry, we're leaving it on. That's the way it goes. All right, speed bump number one. Speed bump number two. Nice. Still seems like kind of a new car to me, folks. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's see what this thing has extra. Whoa. Okay. Well, it does that. <laughs> okay, yeah, I, I now see why uh, this is a pretty fancy vehicle. My head just flew backwards, and uh, this is uh, this is a performance SUV, with no, no doubt. <laughs> I'm just in normal driving mode, too. Um, it's beautiful. It's waiting for your phone. It's waiting for a new owner. It's extremely comfortable. These seats are just, I don't want to get out. The odometer not even up to the odometer shows 19,290 it's still kind of sort of a, it's a it's a quote unquote brand new just broken in kind of sort of vehicle and it's one of the really really nice ones if you've got any more questions give us a call happy to share 2 1 702-818-1031 and uh, you know one of us will be here to answer your questions if you want to know something else but it's here it's available we'll see you next time